Good morning, evening, whenever you're watching this, ladies and gentlemen. It's another episode, Gaming with Gus. We got week two of Mutz Mowers. We're going to get two lawns done today. Relaxing, simple, easy, getting ready for Portland preview. Just get all that energy and hype out. So, yeah, we're just going to keep rocking and rolling. So let's just dive right into it. Got the nice music going. Chats are open. We're going to have a fun night. All right. Well, we only got one thing. Actually, before I do this, we need to repair that vehicle. Actually, no, we don't. Yeah, blades need it. Fill that up. Empty that. All right. We're going to be ready to go cut some grass. Employee is mutt. That's the, the uh, Stiga. Let's go mow some lawn. <sighs> All right, five objects to find. Let's go. The ding is so nice. So if you guys notice, I got a little different setup this week. Hopefully it's a little smoother. Gonna enjoy that. That's three. That's four. Where the hell's that last one? We are looking. Oh, there we go. Found it. <laughs> okay. Um, how do I want to do this? This is going to aggravate everyone again, but I'm actually going to do it this way this time. I'm going to trim first. Yeah. Cut yourself out the nice quarter. Uh, but now I'm excited to see everyone in Portland on Friday. I'll be up there Friday. Very ominous. Uh, 10, 5, 10 minute show today. But nevertheless, onward and upward as uh, I'll be cutting some grass. If I do this trimming first, then whoever says this is unprofessional is completely wrong. Because when I was a landscaper, I would tr usually trim first when I had my solo days. Because it would prevent me. Oh, oh I almost had broke the flower already. Too early to start doing that. Taking your time, cutting it around. The one thing I'll say about this on my PlayStation is the fact that, like, the controller is rumbling in my hands whenever I use the Wii Whacker. It's kind of funny. It's weird. I mean, eventually I'll play Farm Simulator. I have it. It was one of the uh, PlayStation free games. That is a beautiful trim job. Take the corners for safety, but I'll probably end up go just going straight over that anyway. And then, ooh, ooh, can't see. The goal is going to be to have no, uh, how much did I live for Coleman? Good question. Anytime Mutt wants to come and play. He is more than welcome to play on Mutt's, Mutt's Mowers. 
but he's he's just getting all focused for uh, what's it? Thursday is the game, I believe, with uh, UConn against um, San Diego State. Good evening, Chef Lewis. I would edge. So the reason why I would edge first is because when you're going with the lawnmower, if I don't have to worry about getting close to the property, like to the uh, edges, so I could just easily kind of go. Yes, I'm going to end up trimming more, but in the long run, it's going to make my cutting easier. And I just don't like those hard angles like that. So you just clean that out. Nice, nice. Uh, we've got that, so I gotta go clean this bad boy up. Let's get a nice little. The key here is just to give yourself space, you know. What do you mean covered for Coleman? I, I wasn't. There were times I wouldn't cover for Coleman. I would always. I love Coleman. He's just in a rough spot right now. I mean, audio yesterday was something big. So, uh, we'll, uh, we'll, uh, we'll, uh, see. I love Twix. I am a right, uh, right side of Twix fan. Uh, in the great debate, right versus left. See, I'm thinking... I have a couple of ideas. And I thought of one today that I'll probably end up talking with John with later for this, for a, a special event that I can do. Look at that. Look at that. So peaceful. So circular. It looks like it goes to the right. So I'm going to go, keep going this way. Because you always, when you're trimming, you always want to make sure that you're cutting... And blowing the uh, the grass away from beds, driveway, it saves you uh, some blowing in the future, which is nice, um, especially on those like really hot days. But even on like on the really really hot days, the one good thing about it is if you do have like grass and beds and stuff, it's usually so dry. Uh, no, I have not gotten a job yet, but I have had a couple interviews, so talk to some things. We're working on options. We'll see. But yeah, like on the really hot days, at least when the grass was dry, it would blow really quick when you had the blower. So made cleanup pretty easy. And again, you just take your time. Don't roll. That was close. That was dangerously close. Look at that. Boom. And then is this the last one? I believe so. I mean, to beat this level, I probably didn't need to do everything, but yeah, I'm going to do it anyway. I know they're protected flowers. I'm doing the best I can to not destroy them, and I haven't destroyed anything yet. So that's the, uh, that's the play. Um... In my landscaping days, I have killed animals by accident. It is very sad. Uh, it sucks. Like, you, you, there's some you just feel like absolute shit because you just don't see them. It's very sad. Uh, like, I feel like, like obviously, there would usually be rabbits just because with mating season and, like, not just, like, adult rabbits you hit, but you hit baby rabbits and you feel even worse. Oh, God, that, that's rough. Uh, it's one of the crappy things about landscaping. It, it, you feel terrible. It, it, it's the worst. Um, yeah. Look at that. Boom. And that only took me seven minutes to do. So now I'm going to see six to seven centimeters. And I got 30 minutes to do it. Easy. Easy peasy. Yes, I, I, I always would have a moment of silence by myself and then I would just keep going. Oh yeah, look at that. Woo! There it is. Nice and simple. 
this is where I would fuck up a lot because I try to look at the chat. And then I end up, like, cutting like an idiot. Wait a minute. Did I not do it over here? No, I didn't. Okay. Oh, I did not not do this edge. <laughs> well, we can get it after, I guess. Look at that. I thought I trimmed everything, and I didn't. Oh, well. Let's take your time and soothe it easy. I mean, this is just weird having to cut it like this, but I, I hate going through the trees, you know? Ooh. Hey, hey, hey. I'm allowed to mow over the walkways. They don't have rocks in this game, thankfully. But if you guys really don't want me to mow over the brick, I won't. Yeesh. Everybody's a goddamn crew critic. We're good. We're good. We're cruising. We're cruising. My my character's not. This is Mutt, the owner of Mutt's mowers. Oh, we destroyed a flower. Uh, I would actually never um, get high while cutting grass because you're using heavy machinery. Mower's off. See, disengaged. And then we're back to unengaged. Look at that. I did not cut over the brick dime. Second loop. And remember, go vote in uh, John from Scranton's page, the final four. I'm up against Don the Jeweler. I'm not, unlike my opponent, who just has to resort to all these pathetic tactics saying, oh, you be like, yeah, you be like that. No, 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 no. We're running positivity here. We're just going to cut grass and enjoy it. If you like cutting grass, go vote, Gus Boss. I mean, no, and it's people, people have different views of marijuana and ways. And sometimes I like to overindulge and sometimes I just use it normally to help me get through the day. It's, uh, it really does help with my anxiety and everything. And I do like it better, uh, than some of the other medications I've tried in the past. So that's a win, uh, for me right there. And it works for me. Um, and thankfully I'm in a state where it's legal. So 21 plus, but if you are addicted, there is help out there. There are hotlines. And we're back to cutting this grass. This is where we get to speed it up a little bit now though. Getting some comfort. Get in the rhythm. The dogs are good. They're uh, surprisingly behaving right now, uh, which is nice. Um, 
when the dogs behave, it's uh, always a good thing. But sometimes they, so far they've been good. Yeah, they've been good. No issues. It's all happy. Crazy, you know, how dogs be. Not a bad slogan, Mother's Cat, Kirk's Mother's Casket. Oh, shit. They, see, this is why I like to trim first, because then I don't leave these annoying little uh, pieces like this. I'm going to cut right on the edge as close as I can get. Look at that. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Slow and steady wins the race, boys. That's all you got to do. Uh, I cannot control the hair. Unfortunately, this game really doesn't have that good customization options. Uh, but there, there are some games I want to play, and I've seen that are pretty fun. And I could probably make one a character definitely look like my, one of them. I mean, I, it's, I'm a pizza guy and I'm a Taco Bell guy, Andy, um, for sure, uh, because I love pizza. Pizza is my favorite food, period. Cheese pizza, simple, easy, and when it's done right, it's absolutely fantastic. So, uh, definitely pizza, and, and I mean, come on, T-Bell, like, it's a guilty pleasure. Let's talk about it. What do, you, what, do I, what do I have to say about the producers? It's a, it's a big task. Um, I feel bad for them. Uh, Cub Cadet. My, my parents were always a Cub Cadet guy, JD. Uh, but yeah, no, I, I feel for the producers right now. Like They're under a, amounts of pressure. Um, they put their jobs on the line. Uh, and like obviously after today, like something happened. So I don't know what happened. I'm not going to speculate what happened. All I'm going to do is be there on Friday night, see some Minifans, go to Gritty's. If Mike needs any help with Mike and the Minifans, be there and then be ready for uh, be ready for the uh, what's it called the the State Theater on Saturday and whatever Kirk needs during the day. If anything, I'll be up there, hands ready to go. And like if. If I'm told, like, be, be this, do this, do you need me to be this, I'll be 100% whatever they need. Everyone knows that. I have no backbone. That's that's up to them. They're, they're, they're in the firing squad. Like, not going to lie, I feel quite nice right now. I'm feeling good, relaxed, cutting grass, enjoying some ginger ale, have my uh, pen next to me. So it's all, it, everything's looking up Gus. My go-to Taco Bell order. See this, it depends on two situations. They used to have the uh, the beefy five-layer box. Oh no, not the beef, it was, it was a beefy five-layer burrito, a cheesy gordita crunch, and chips and cheese. So I would get that with two soft tacos, which is nice. Uh, but they don't have that anymore because of their new menu. So I'll just get the soft taco meal, three soft tacos, uh, no lettuce because I'm not a rabbit, uh, and then an order of the chips and cheese, and then a beefy five-layer burrito. That is my go-to order. It's I, I don't I it's my guilty ple it's one of my many guilty pleasures. I love Taco Bell.
Oh, uh, God. Rune, I haven't... Like, I've... I've tried to get back into RuneScape a couple times. That is so such an old game. I remember being like 10 and 11 or 12 or 13. I forget how old I was playing RuneScape. No, see, the reason why I don't get the lettuce is because when I get the chips and the cheese, I put the chips in it. So I get that nice crunch, which is much better than the lettuce crunch, in my opinion. You know? Ten or twenty. Oh, God, yeah. Never a Club Penguin guy. See, but 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 Jeremy, there's there's a little reasons why I'm doing this, my friend. Like, like Jeremy, the, it, it, if you listen to the show, this makes total sense. A hundred and twenty percent thousand ch chances right here. This makes a hundred percent chance. This isn't copying what Big D was trying to do. You can go bitch about the fucking Tennessee when they get their ass kicked next week. I don't know. This is Mutt's Mullers. We're gonna, we're gonna will Mutt into getting a job. As like, Mutt the landscaper would be great. Just saying, Mutt the landscaper would be awesome. Yes, they do give you a weed whacker. That's I, I use the weed whacker first just to uh, make sure everything was cleaned up. That's right. Uh, there's different tasks. The first, the, the step here is just to cut the grass, make the money, and then it's so I can upgrade my equipment. That's the goal. If I cut it, like, if I finish, oh, I'm not going to finish this in 10 minutes. No fucking way. Damn straight three-point turn. It's the only way you get those, like, straight lines so you don't miss a, miss a cut. And if you go slow, it's okay. The only time the three-point turn really fucks you is when you going too fast, then you dig up the lawn, and then they get mad at you, which is rightfully so. Good look at that. Oh, cutting it close. That's why you're driving the gust bus. <laughs> I do not get to do baseball. Like, I want a game where I could do, like, how awesome would it be if there was a game that you could cut the Masters? Like, cut TPC Sawgrass? Like, that would be fun. They should add that in the uh, next EA or PGA 2K game. I don't play Fortnite, surprisingly. I, it's, I just don't like it. I liked it for a bit. I get, like, hot and cold on it. And it was on a long cold streak, so I was like, I'm good. The dream is to get Flight Simulator with, like, sticks and then a VR. Nah, I have well, I have my P uh, place the VR one from PlayStation. So in theory, 
I could. Oh, that would be funny one day, I think. But then I wouldn't be able to see the chats. And that would be tough. The agenda for tomorrow. Uh, good question. So my, my day tomorrow is I'm going to wake up, take the dogs out, feed them, apply for a couple more jobs I've uh, been looking at, uh, clean the house, um, and then pack up and get ready because on Friday uh, I will be going up to Portland middle of the day, probably around like 12-ish, 11, 12. No, it's a different lawn, uh, Kyle. There is, there is, I, Penners, there is, you know what? You know what, Penners? I have Train Simulator 3, and I have the Acela Northeast and the MBTA Northeast expansion where I can drive the MBTA and actually be on time. I'm telling you, I love, like, when I was landscaping, I hated it because it's like what you're doing every day, monotonous in the sun, it's frustrating. But, like, now with my, I love cutting my grass. Getting ready to get the fertilizer down, gonna. Gonna just enjoy it. I don't need, you can just ask me a question right now. I don't, I, I'm confident I am smarter than Coleman. I am 1000% confident I am smarter than Coleman. No gravity hits. Jeez. I'm not, I'm not like stone stone. Jesus, people. Yeah, and he'll probably go, I went to BC. BC's in trouble. That, like, again. Oh, I mean, the shoe fits. I love, I love Coleman, though. How are space and time similar? So time is a made-up construct by human beings to get a grasp on and some sense of normalcy throughout the day to understand. Uh, whereas space is an entity that we made up that we know very little about, and some people have made up a lot of stuff about it. So there's there's just similarities between space and time. Thank you, JD. I just, I'm, I'm here to give everybody a good, relaxing time. I'm sorry, Chef. 
Sorry, I can't help you. If it, like I said, if this was a golf course, ah. okay. But that's a very fair point. I but I, I think mine's more likely. Because I do what I want, Cabaret Kirk. See, just wait. Everyone's got to be a little patient because once I can get a zero turn, then we'll be cooking with peanut oil. Marry, fuck, kill. Burgers, burritos... I'm marrying pizza. Ah, yeah, I'm marrying pizza. I'm fucking burritos and I'm killing burgers. I think that's the play. That's a good one, Paul. Good question, Paul. Glad to see in your retirement you have important questions for mutts mowers. As you can see, it's not engaged, so I'm not cutting that. Coleman did not offer me money to lie for him. I will not take this Coleman slander. He's a lovable moron. Oh, I'm marrying walking the dogs. Fucking the shit out of lawn care. And I'm killing house cleanup. That's easy. No, so no, no. See, like, let's let's face like the fucking burger. Like, no, 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 no. If you fuck the burger, it's just so unfun. There's nothing fun about it. I have never been intimate with a man. Like I said on the show, there was one time I kissed a man by accident, and that was it. Like a quick peck, freaked out. Not for me. I am an ally. Marry, fuck, kill, ooh. I mean, you gotta marry Steve. He's like, he's gonna protect you at the end of the day. And that's what really what you need. So you marry Steve, you fuck Cullinane. And then I'm sorry, you gotta kill Coleman and Justin. Like, Justin's weight loss theory. Coleman's not knowing of Jim Tomei. I didn't say I went to interviews. I had a couple phone interviews, sir. McGriddle, Crunchwrap, Supreme, and Popeye's Chicken Sandwich. I'm marrying the Crunchwrap. I'm fucking the shit out of that McGriddle. And then I'm uh, killing the Popeye's Chicken Sandwich. Yeah, I'll definitely do a uh, Goose's Cooked episode for sure. Like, I'm 100% in for a Goose is Cooked episode. But it's not like... I never said it was like my famous shepherd's pie. Yeah, there's a lot of things I regret uh, about my time as um, producer. I mean, yeah, I, if I could take some shit back, 100%. Not a bad cook. Mary, fuck, kill, indica, sativa. So, see, I haven't done magic mushrooms, so I'm going to kill those. Um, but again, I've done too much research uh, for that. And then, uh, Mary, 
I'm, I'm marrying the indica and I'm fucking the sativa because that's it. I'm not. I don't get as tired on sativa. Um, and it actually really does, it like helps me for my knee pain. Um, but I, I'd, I'd marry the indica for sure. That's a good question. That is a very good question. There's what I allow. My, I mean, I know she would never. So, I mean, if, a, if it's like a life or death situation, yeah. I mean, if it was an order to keep her, yeah. I mean, I'd do anything to keep her, so. No, I would not watch. That that's the watching is too far. I couldn't I couldn't watch. I'm not a cock. I'm sorry. Not my thing. Good questions though tonight, guys. I like it. Because we're taking our time, Sammy, and we're enjoying good conversation, sir. We're almost done. We're at the end. Look at that. Look at all this. Do -do 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 um, definitely the the pen is when I'm out in public, just to like keep me balanced and happy. Um. I have a Pax at home I usually use, but I, I, I enjoy a nice joint now and then. Um, especially with the buddies, the fellas, passing it around. Someone, the Bears has not listened to the show. We had a caller call in um, uh, talking about this specifically. Something Jared Carabas and I share in common. Both uh, had that happen to us. All right, we're done. I'm only 550 over. That's not bad. One flower destroyed. Let's get out of here. Did I go the wrong way? I went the wrong way. Got to fill up that tank. Got to change those blades. And we're good to go to the next location. Look at that. Beautiful. You hear that rooster? The rooster is even impressed with me. See, that's what we want. We got Dino Safari. Dino Safari. Ooh, newcomer rank two. A new place to cut. Wow. Ooh, we might get some dino stuff, guys.
Ladies and oh, that's a big one though. That'll take me so long. What's that? Thirty-eight man. This is a big one. This is that's a bit, and then I could do this one though. Smaller. Fuck, I can't believe I'm going to do this to myself, but let's do this much. We want the money. We want the money. But on this one, first things first. Actually, let's take care of this. Ooh, ooh. Let's see. I'm at 1,100, so let's do this. Full repair. Empty that. Oh, do I buy it? Do we upgrade it? I can upgrade to this one. Come on, chat. I need I need an answer from the chat. Do I get the knight? We're doing it. We got the knight. New lawn mower. Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh. We got some rock features. This is a big property. But we're going to do it, guys. Seven pieces are on the ground. Let's see if I can find them. One. Shit. Where are they? Yeah. Three more objects left, guys. Uh, Mrs. Gus is asleep. She's got to work in the morning. <laughs> and I'm up here playing video games. Love her to death. We're not going to cut the stream this time. I'm at the very end. No hard out. I promise two lawns. We're getting two lawns. On uh, on my personal Twitch stream, I almost did a uh, stream earlier this afternoon uh, in, with uh, Beanbag Ron, trying to get him to level 50 in Call of Duty. So we're going to be pushing for that. I'm, I'm curious to see how far he's uh, gotten in that. Oh, I think I found the last one. That is one thing I'll say about the game. There it is. Yep. That if you like on these big maps, it's like you kind of look up like towards the rock. You can see how it's like all flat and looks mode. Yeah, you can see it right over there. So with that is that's how I'm easily able to see objects. Like look at all that open grass objects stand right out on that. So Microsoft needs to fix that. So uh, shout out. I have not. I have a Doom VR cut height range seven to eight. All right. The good news is this cut height is seven. All right, let's do this. There we go. A little bit louder. I, I'm not a wrestling fan. Um, I've tried to get into a couple times. I might go watch it at my buddy Derek's house. Shout out, Derek.
get some, uh, I don't know what the proper word for it is, so I'm not going to try, but these are rolling gr hills. Yeah, this new whip is dope. That's it. Undulating hill. Undulating. Undulating? Undulating? I can't pronounce that, but. Cutting hills in real life are is terrifying sometimes. Like, there is one, um, if anyone knows Bristol, Rhode Island, uh, the soccer fields next to Cold State Park, there was this old armory that I used to cut, and some days I uh, would have to cut the hill. And it is the steepest and scariest thing ever. And it like you drive by it, it doesn't look that bad. But when you're on a uh, lawnmower, it is. You start to slip, slide. You gotta cut straight up, straight down. You don't fuck around on that. Uh, No, he can eat it, the snacks into the mic as much as he wants. He's always done that. Again, is this your first? Is these people's first time listening to the show? Like, he's been doing that forever. When he gets hungry, wants to make a little snacky snack. He's a snacky snack. You know? Nothing wrong with that. Down a little poopy, that's right. I appreciate all the new viewers and stuff, but like, come on, people, there's some things you gotta know. I'm not, I mean, I, I'm twitching. It's very hot in here because of the lights and stuff. I'm very curious if I go look at my, uh, what the temperature in this room is. But it is quite warm. Yeah. Food, Sammy. I eat food. I would not be interested in a night with your wife, Charlie. I'm sorry. Not my thing. <laughs> Am I going to Portland? Of course I'm going to Portland, people. Jeez. going to Portland. Dumb question from Mick. Dumb question. It's funny you said that, Michael Flood, because I was just reading a post on uh, X that was like, um, what's it? Uh, it was like this Christian family. They had this bowl and he was he was fine with them fucking but he didn't like that he took her to his protestant church and she might get baptized in the protestant church it's very funny so for the first one is oh shit 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 oh that's bad we're in trouble this is a tough one Ooh, there we go good enough for now Oh, no, I'll be going. Uh, I'll be in Portland. I'm going up Friday. I'm, the wife's coming with me. So, yeah. I'm going to be around Friday night. Going to go to Mike and the Minifans. And then Saturday, if 
Kirk or anyone on the show needs me for anything, I'm available to help. If not, I'll be out seeing uh, you guys. So, I'm just excited for it all. Can't wait for it to happen. The show's being canceled today and tomorrow. Um, my assumption is that they just have to film more stuff. I don't know anything. I'm going to be very clear about that. I have no clue about what, uh, what happened before. All I know is that I was looking forward to some shows and now Portland's going to be awesome. I mean, I mean, Friday, Friday, hopefully, I mean, if, if Coleman and Justin rob us of a Mayo, Jeff D. Lowe, I'm not going to bang Mick on stage in Portland. That's not, nah, no. Nah. Not going to have. See, I got to be careful here. This is the only like problem with this one is that it's so high. I can't go super fast. So I'm trying not to uh, overload the engine so I can keep the uh, mower in good shape. But yeah, no, if if Coleman and Justin cost us the Jeff D. Low Mayo episode Friday, not going to be good. I don't listen to Mayo, so it's fine. He's just a miserable guy on the cross. Sh- Across the street, as everyone likes to say. Yeah, see, there's the warning again. I have no clue. I, I I don't know. I don't. I the one thing I I I know everyone involved is taking this seriously, and it's going to be awesome. Because like last time, Kirk said he's going to put everything to Detroit. It, it's awesome. It's the last the last Portland one. It, it was great, fantastic. This one's going to be awesome. Seeing all that high grass makes me ugh. No, I don't want to. I am happily married, Mr. Wiggy. Happily married. I can't even help Mick speak Portuguese. I'm sorry. Or Spanish, for that matter. I thought you said they were Portuguese. Brazilian, yeah. Yes. I don't know. Again, I don't know anything about Portland. I'm just a fan. And life is a nightmare. I'm just a fan. I know that it's not fair. Oh, hell yeah, I'll play GTA 6. No, Kirk fired me. That was clear. Hey, if I'd love to, but no. Top five bands of 2000. Uh, For me, Green Day, Blink-182, Simple Plan. Um, I did like Good Charlotte. And All American Rejects. It's a pretty good five. I got name five on that. Hell yeah. That's Saki. And there was I, I I'm pretty sure I told the story about the Saki date last time. I know I've said that before. It's a very funny story. I was the Saki king.
Ha! <laughs> you got me. You got me, BA. That was bizarre. Yeah, it, the the fact I've I've never never would have thought Poppy to kid for a 20-year-old. Oh, I would be. I want to learn to play drums. Like I can keep a basic beat. I feel like I'd be a halfway decent drummer. What's the difference between hungry and horny? Oh. What's the difference? Ah, hey -o. Good. Good one, Wiggy. Yes, I'll have to weed whack after. Sometimes I do it before, sometimes I do it after. God, this property is so big. I am into a, adult Lego sets. Um, that is actually something something involving Legos was proposed by me to Mick for a challenge. Because he said he wanted the challenge for me. And I thought I had a halfway decent one. And if you see, yeah, there's one right behind me. You can see it right there. That's the uh, Thor uh, Milnor. Um, Milnor. Hammer. It's It gets easier, Sammy, when I get better mowers. Right now, I'm doing the best I can. It's it's an open sandbox. You just keep mowing and making money and getting stuff and buying upgrades. Uh, like you you expand the bays, you hire people. My lines are squarely right now. I'm sorry. I didn't bring anything to Cancun. The wife was uh, very, very clear about that. But we did get stopped uh, going into Mexico. Customs in Mexico did stop us. So that was fun. And like even even the guys like didn't make weed. He's like, I, he's like, you bring weed? I go, no. He goes, why not? I, go, I wish I did. Yes, that's cheating. 100%. I do. Sometimes I walk them. Sometimes I let them run around in the yard. I have like a little dogger and I have to clear. So they get a little bit of everything. Yeah, the guy was awesome. Uh, my order from the Halfway Cafe. I, like, I mean... Sometimes I get the French dip sandwich. I'll get a burger, bacon burger. I've gotten the Caesar wrap there. I don't care how much I waste, Jameson. I'm just here having fun. It, again, Coleman, I, I mean, I'm not a strip club guy. I'm not a fan of it. It just doesn't do it for me. I'm like, why would I just go pay to get blue balls or pay three four hundred dollars for whatever happens in the uh uh what's it called champagne room yeah 
once I get a better 360 turn mower, See, 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 the, the problem is if I only overlap by one wheel, I have to, I have to cut this up because then if I don't, then I overheat my engine and then I do damage to the mower and that costs more in the long run. It's going to take a little bit. It take it again it's 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 growing pains you guys wanted the big one i tried to do the smaller one you're like nah go for the big one no not sure that won't get done quicker i'm not lying sir So you can see my... Oh, you can't see the engine condition because it's right under uh, Gaming with Gus. It's gone down a little bit. The vehicle condition's good, though. That means I haven't hit anything. Oh, see? Warning, you're overloading the engine. Can't do that. No, they were truly my friends and cousins were playing. I wasn't playing the whole time. There were a couple times I popped on for like a little bit, but definitely wasn't uh, me the whole time. Yeah, I think we can bust out the wheel next week. I got to make sure it's compatible and it works. But yeah, as long as it works. Yeah, sometimes you got to do that as it clumps up. But again, if this is one of the first cuts of the year too, the grass is going to be growing going to start to get that thick coat. I do have an idea, though. Nah, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to give in to you guys. The grass does grow back. This game can't end. This is the game that never ends. Just goes on and on, my friends. I would be curious if uh, Bird Call Guy could identify whatever birds they have piped into this game. So I'll be quiet, see if we can, we can hear it. Andy, if you think Kirk works less than 20 hours a week, you're a fucking moron. <laughs> it was the Taco Bell order of the uh, three soft sale tacos, the beefy five layer burrito, and the chips and cheese. <laughs> and of course, with a Baja Blast. What kind of bird was that? What kind of bird was that? Not true at all. I'm not a bird guy. I thought about it. That could be cool, like smoking a joint, watching the birds come in. Never, uh, never played RimWorld.
One move. Okay. Deserted island. One fast food chain. I, I don't get paranoid. Uh, not at all. I'm doing whatever I want, bro. That's not true at all. My brother's awesome. But no, but but to be a bird guy, I have to get binoculars. I got to start listening. I got to start seeing and identifying. That's not true at all. I was a loser in high school. Everyone knows that. That was a good bird chirp. Beep. I'm not answering the salary question. Next. I don't know what Coleman's salary is. I didn't ask these questions. Jeez, everyone's getting nosy now. The best GTA game is five. I'm sorry. I know it's meant forever, but it's been a lot of fun. What's your definition of a real game? Absolutely not. I'm, I'm, again, I have a low stress, smiles, relax. I'm excited for the show. I can't wait to see it. I do not drive high. You never drive high. That's a dumb question. I do have Farm Simulator. Yeah, I know. That's why I'm trying to go slow. Again, I'm going to aggravate everyone for doing this, but I don't care. Yeah. Yeah. This is for Jameson right here. Just going back and forth. Back and forth. I do. I watch uh, some stuff. I wasn't smoking the pen. I had the pen with me, like, in my hand, because I was collecting stuff from the car. Jesus. Uh, I would not have done those uh, streams with a Spanish accent, Mr. Fry. 
do 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 Selma Hayek is an oofy maloofy. For sure. She was great in Grown Ups and Grown Ups too. Look at that miss I did. I'm so disappointed in myself. I'm talking to people in the YouTube chat, Bink De Dreer. That's right. I have the YouTube and the Twitch chat going. I got two. And yet you are, Mr. Jameson. Thank you. Thank you. Look at that line. I have to go back with the weed whacker. I'm such an idiot. I I don't think so. My guess I saw a tweet about it and Kirk said absolutely not. So I'm gonna guess no. Um if you listen to the Kirk Minahan show, it's RFK. I'm an RFK guy. I never sold drugs to high school. I never sold drugs, surprisingly enough. Uh it's a different lawn, Pat Ford. The good news is we're halfway done. So I'm hoping to get this lawn done in under an hour. Hoping. You guys wanted the big one. I've never been pecked. No. Uh, there's your answer, Jameson. No. I'm having a blast. I love this game. No, I'm not going to cry when Trump wins. Thing, I, 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 I'm going to keep having bad lines. Blurred lines. I know you want it. I know you want it. You guys hear those birds? Those birds were beautiful. No. I was not. Sorry to disappoint you. No. Exit only out that hole. I'm sorry. Exit only. Pretty sure that's one of the bad jokes I made on the show. I'll get a tramp stamp that says exit only. That's what it sounds like, and it's not going to happen. No. No, I do. Or don't I? Or do I? Or don't I?
I've debated it, Joe. I've debated it. I love roller coasters. I we talk again, we talked about this on the show. I would I'd love to go like not gonna lie, when we do the shows across the country, I hope we stop for at least one roller coaster ride somewhere. Who's gonna tell Poppy? Not at all. I'm actually going to be going in April, the end of April. My wife's friends are getting married in Minnesota where she grew up and where she was from. So I'm going to the Mall of America and I'm going to have a few hours to spend there. But I, I, like I want to go ride that classic roller coaster and like recreate the scene from uh, Mighty Ducks. Everyone's, I don't know. Like, I don't know anything. I know nothing. Was that Sergeant Schultz? I know nothing. Nothing. Yeah, ground bees are bad. Um... There was one time I was I had to use when we were doing landscaping. My uh, that was like the one thing about landscaping that sucked. Well, a few things sucked about it, but like my uh, my foreman was allergic to bees. So whenever there's no bees in the game, my foreman was allergic to bees. So whenever there was like a bees nest or something, I had to go cut near it. And of course, guess who would get stung? Zzz, zzz, zzz. Thank you, Jameson. Thanks for the pep talk. Yeah, it's chill. Look at my hang. Hog. Haug. Hog. Whoa, 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 whoa. Golf sucks. No, 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 no. Golf doesn't suck. Dude, Otani definitely bet on the game. I'm not going to sleep myself streaming tonight. See, the the whenever I stream myself sleeping, I have to sleep in... Not my bed. The guest bed is comfortable, but it's not my bed comfortable. My king size bed's awesome. Yeah, when I'm when I'm disc golfing, we usually have to look out for the uh, ground bees, especially uh, springtime. Like some of them get freaking gnarly. I mean, look at we're just little old uh, disc golfers trying. I I joked about it when I turned 30 trying to get Rogaine to sponsor me. But no, I would never dye my beard. Not good. I'm like 750 rated. Somewhere between 750 and 800, I think. Could be lower. I'm not a Republican, though. Um, 
I'm nothing. I am not drunk. Again, Jameson, that is absolutely wrong. Oh, Farmville was... I mean, I remember Farmville. I'm not liberal, though. I'm not liberal. Like, I have some conservative views. I have some progressive views. There's some things from the Republican Party that I like, some things from the Democrat Party I like. There's things from the Republican Party I don't like. Things from the Democrat Party I don't like. It's common sense here, people. I wouldn't say addict, sir. I know Kirk said addict, but I'm not an addict. I mean, I, I appreciate Jameson for watching this long. I think he's been in from the beginning. And he's just been miserable the entire time. I, I agree. Loving politicians is very creepy. I have friends who are politicians. People are going to hate it. People are going to love it. We're going to just cut the grass. Good news is we're making some progress. Look at all this. I'm proud of you, Jameson. I don't know. I don't know what the number is. Hey, don't be making fun of my family. See. <clears throat> See, here's the thing about mixed situation relationship advice he's he's at the point where it's a ring or it's gonna end he's getting to that point feel for him however with that being said gonna have to make a choice it's I, I i honestly think she wants the security and steady income and if you're gonna want that it's not gonna be in, as kirk said it's not gonna be in broadcast no way shape or form but if she like just lay it out to her even like because even when i went through the producer search i, I was very clear with my wife like hey like this is gonna happen this the, like yeah so 
Jameson, I'm going to keep talking as much as I want because it's my stream. Is this going to start turning into an advice show? I know last week we were talking, uh, talking mutt advice. This week we're talking make advice. Anyone else want advice? If you want, it, there's look at the end of the day. See, I, you can't, you can't blame Mick for being a little narcissistic and selfish in this point because the saying, my saying has always been, from the day you're born to the day you die, there's only one person in your life 24/7, and that's yourself. So you need to do what's best for you. And sometimes it's tough decisions. A lot of people need to learn to say that. I'm not saying this about Coleman. I'm just saying there's a lot of people that need to learn to say, yeah, I suck. I can do it. I suck at a lot of things. See, Jameson, what you forgot is I also went to go see Moulin Rouge at PPAC. Can't forget that. That was in it. That's a very good question, uh, Hose Minifan. Um, you just put as much slide powder as you want on. Very fair question. Um, and uh, like going back to, yeah, yeah. Fair question. I'm going to leave it at that. General Gooch, there is no strategy except to get every blade of grass. I disagree with that because sometimes you want to make sure that you got to. And, and part of the other thing, Jesse, is if I do overload the mower like that, I have to back up because there will be grass left over. Thanks, Joe. I'll try to. Uh, It, it, it's what it is. And sometimes I got to go really slow. Oh, no. I am almost out of gas. I'm almost out of gas. Back to full gas. Right now, we'll be streaming on the Kirk Minahan Show Network every Wednesday. Um, and then you can follow me on. See, look at this. Right over here, Jesse. This is why I have to back up. I have to go get that grass. Yeah, I pissed all you off for doing that. Um. If... As I've always said, uh, General, if the show needs me for anything, I'm happy to help. I lied about having a job just because I was just like, yeah, whatever. That I don't know. Sounds like there's no show today or tomorrow. We'll see. But I don't know.
I've I if Mutt wants to start a landscaping company, I'd be happy to help him with it. I'd be his first employee. I'm gonna keep reversing all I want. Boop boop boop. It means eh, whatever. I would love for Mutt to have an have an appearance on the stream. Just the idea of Mutt gaming would be uh, funny. There is no end game, Jameson. There is no end game, and I'm glad. It, it it truly is an honor that people think about me this much. You know, it feels nice. That could be, that's a good idea. That's a good idea, slightly stalled. Very good idea. We got to have a night of mutt. That's, that's the play. That's the play. Good call, slightly stalled. No, this is a gas mower. They do have the Ego mowers in here. And I will get one eventually. Because there are like... Some properties in this require ego motors because they care about the environment. I mean, much just gonna go like if much just go sh like Mike can pull off the short hair like he doesn't have to go big shave. But he can definitely cut it short and buzz it. If I could tell Kirk one thing without lying, no, I, I was grateful for the opportunity. And if he ever needed help, I'd be there in a second. And I'm definitely someone who learns from his mistakes. As everyone knows, I'm second, I'm second attempt Gus. First attempt's always a fucking, wow. Second attempt, all right, we got it. He's good. I'm not going to tell you where I live in Bridgewater. There's been enough context clues thrown out there that I'm not going to add fuel to the fire. Awesome! I forgot that I was the one that made him say that awesome. Awesome! Oh, that's a big miss. That's my bad. I may have been. I may have been.
what guests do I truly dislike? I mean, I, I really don't dislike anyone now. I mean, Mick and I have kind of gotten over our thing. It's fine. I'm just an easy go with the flow vibes guy. Positive vibes. Yes, as soon as the show over, he goes, thanks. See you guys. Boom. Done. Coleman works over 40 for sure. Between all the editing and, and the filming they do, yeah. Both of them work. He just leaves for the day to go work on the show, do other things. Like, I don't know what he does. Comes in, does the show. And he leaves. I was going to try it, didn't want to do it. I've said it before. I think Coleman's going to win. Justin may lose more. I don't know. Like this Justin strategy just fucking. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I love my dogs too much. Oh, well, quite contraire. I was very good at Little League. I was a catcher and second baseman. Catcher for my team during the regular season and the All-Star game, they moved me to second base because I was too small and didn't have that strong of an arm, which was a smart move. 
But man, I was a damn good leadoff hitter. I was short. I used to do the Ichiro thing and the Nomar glove thing. Oh, I was a douche. Major douche. Oh, yeah. We'll get onto the stone figures with the weed whacker in a little bit. I mean, I, he's, he's viewing. He's a dedicated viewer slightly. I, I, I appreciate it. If, if me playing this game aggravates him this much, it actually makes me feel pretty fucking good about myself. What's it? It's almost midnight. It's almost midnight, and I'm still cutting this fucking lawn. I mean, you gotta kill... You gotta kill Murchison. Because that's the easy one. Then, I guess... You just... You fuck manners because you just do it once, and then you're done with him. He's... And then, uh, so I guess I'm marrying, marrying Jameson because... Jameson's always going to call me out on my shit. Um, if he's not happy with me, he'll he'll be honest and blunt about it. So uh, I, I appreciate that. No, I said marry Jameson, and you know when you're married, that doesn't happen. Nice try there, buddy. Nice try. Anthony Hopkins. That was the guy in, um... He was uh, Hannibal Lecter, right? Yeah, I think so. He's a good actor. If it's the one I'm thinking of. If not, eh, well, I'm an idiot. It rubs the lotion on its skin or else it gets the hose again. The past two years, the longest I've gone smoking without weed. I've, I mean, I've done it for like 
probably like a month, a month and a half maybe. All right, we're almost done here, ladies and gentlemen. Now we get to get the weed whacker out. Woo. You guys want to check my plans again? I already told you guys. I'm going to take care of the dogs, clean the house, get ready for Portland. Done, done, done. The only time I was high in studio was when I ate the 500 milligrams. Uh, honestly, I was too afraid to do anything um, like that while in studio. Packing clothes, other stuff. No, that we would be here for hours. Like, I'm not ready for that long. Like, we, we might... If I did that, we probably wouldn't be done by the time the show started. It's a string. See, that's a string. Let me see if I can get a better view of that string for you so you can actually see it. Yeah, good. See? It's a string, not a blade. And it, nope, this is gas as well. It's a two-stroke gas. I do. I love my in-laws, Richard and Tina. They're awesome. In-laws are great. They live in Utah. They took me to the Brigham Young house. That was fun. Oil mixture, yeah. Probably, uh, I forget what it was. Like it's like a three to one, four to one ratio usually. I don't know. All I just remembered it was one little small uh, thing of it for the small ones and two for the big ones when I did it. I'm not Mormon. No, no, no. I'm not Mormon, but I have a, I have a book of Mormon around here somewhere. Um, that was one of the things I asked my wife's family to get me was a book of uh, the Bible. So they got one. It's very easy to get in Utah. Favorite place to eat in Carson City? Uh, Bully Sports Bar I lived near was very nice uh, to go to. Um, uh, what's it? Yeah, I would say that was one of them. Uh, there was like a wine bar attached to a casino that was nice. Oh, Sassafras was good. Sassafras out in Carson City was one of probably one of my favorite places to go eat. They had this, um, it was a grilled ham and brie with potato chips in it. That was absolutely, oh, contract complete. We did it. 64.51. Oh, I should pick up the grass. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. We did it. Let's see, how do we do? Did I, oh, there we go. Oh, I broke the game. Do -do -do -do. Let's see.
Look at that. $945 value. We made $977. We made more money, guys. Mud Smowers did it. Pumped on that one. Two lawns, like I promise. Thank you guys for watching. I'm pointing to the other screen. That's where the camera is. Thank you guys for tuning in. And uh, I'm not going to Plymouth, Ryan. I'm going to Portland. And make sure you guys all get out there too because the show is going to be great. Uh, thank you to John behind the running this all. Thank you for everyone who watched for an hour and 52 minutes. Cutting grass. Have a good night, everybody.